Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Welcome to Coffee Break with Rabbi Laura. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Today is Wednesday, December 9th. And today we have an Oracle's Day. Today we have an Oracle's Day. Where is everybody? <laughs> Where are you? Good morning. How are you? We're going to use the gospel, gospel of Aradia, the Gospel of Aradia by Stacey DeMarco. We're going to use the Divine Feminine by Tamara von Forslund. I interview her for um, January. She's going to be on my show. And we have the Four Agreements by Don Miguel Ruiz. So don't miss, don't miss the show, and don't miss today the oracles, of course. But um, don't miss the show, Lady Tamara. She's amazing. She's very interesting and fun. Oh my gosh, she's so much fun. Hi, Teresa. Hi, Wanda. Good morning, everybody. I hope you're all doing great. So anyway, um. Today we're doing oracles. Hi, Carries. And let us go ahead with the first oracle today. Um, I really love this oracle by Lady Tamara. And we're going to see what card we have for today. It's a big oracle. But the good thing is the cards are soft. So you can bend them a little so you can actually uh, shuffle them. But yeah, it is a big, big, big oracle. And let's see what the Great Mother has for us as a message today. I had to put on my glasses because otherwise I cannot read. Oh, look at this beautiful card. Goddess Nut. Nut? Nut. I don't know how to pronounce it. N U T nut, not <laughs> can be not. <laughs> hi Michelle and hi Jackie. Good morning. Okay, so the message says, "Let this great mother awaken within your spirit." Then you can say, "I am the universe. I am the womb of all life. I will awaken and illuminate into the world of my dreams." These dreams will become your reality and reveal your divine truth. Mistakes are your special tools to learn and grow. In case you've been going through some mistakes, there's the message we all have, don't we? There you go. That's one. <laughs> Let this great mother awaken within your spirit. Then you can say, I am the universe. I am the womb of all life. I will awaken and illuminate into the world of my dreams. These dreams will become your reality and reveal your divine truth. Mistakes are your special tools to learn and grow. That's the message from the Divine Feminine Oracle. And we're going next to pull one of the, the Gospel of Aradia, work by Stacey DeMarco. Two Australians today. I didn't intend it. I, I just realized the two wonderful artists from Australia. And I had interviewed Stacey DeMarco before. You can go into the Lunatic Mondays archives, the CSMP, the Circle Sanctuary Network podcast, and you can find the interview with... Uh, Stacy and Marco as well, and I did one with Lady Tamara before, so they're all uh, there. Hi Kelly, hi Jeno, hi Alex. Good morning. All right, let's see what the Gospel of Aradia has for us today. And we have Night Woman. 
femi feminine noctis, night woman. They are similarly looking. <sighs> Folks, I'm telling you, you cannot make this up. You cannot make this up. Wow. Huh. That is awesome. So, Night Woman, let's see what the um, Oracle has. It reads, expect joy and good luck to visit your home. A spring clean of your home or office is in order. Reduce the clutter and clear the energy. Healing can be done in joy and with movement. Go dance and love your body in all its splendor. I know this is this sounds weird, right? Because spring cleaning in winter. But I think they're referring to the act of a deep cleaning. And not necessarily to wait for spring to clean. Expect joy and good luck to visit your home. A spring clean of your home or office is in order. Reduce the clutter and clear the energy. Healing can be done with joy and with movement. Go dancing. Love your body in all of splendorness. So there you have it. Movement, clean, and being in touch with your body. I think um, <clears throat> it's good to know, to notice, to say, uh, a lot of us have been very inactive, obviously, because we've been in quarantine. Um, but, you know, have you danced with your dog? <laughs> I dance with my dog, and he gets scared. He don't like it. Oh, because I pick him up. I pick him up like a baby, and he don't like that. But anyway, dance with dance on your socks <laughs> and try to find some joy in life. You know, it's I know it's been challenging, but we can do it. All right. Last but not least, don't overdo. Don't overdo your do. <laughs> this is from the agreement of always do your best. And it says don't overdo. Always do your best, but don't overdo. When you overdo, you deplete your body and go against yourself. And it will take you longer to accomplish your goal. I repeat. Always do your best, but don't overdo. When you overdo, you deplete your body and go against yourself, and it will take you longer to accomplish your goal. Hey, um, do you guys want another card? Do you guys want another card? Quickly, quickly, say yes or no. We have two minutes. I think we should do it. Let's pull another card. This one. Don't make assumptions. Let your life be transformed. Don't make assumptions. Let your life be transformed. When you stop making assumptions, your world becomes impeccable and your life is less and your life is completely transformed. Magic just happens in your life. What you need comes to you easily because spirit moves freely through you. When you stop making assumptions, your world becomes impeccable and your life is completely transformed. Magic just happens in your life. What you need comes to you easily because spirit moves freely through you. Thank you everybody for watching. Thank you for playing and thank you for being here. Um, I will see you all Friday with learning the card of the day. Don't forget to watch Lunatic Mondays and Mondays, to listen to Lunatic Mondays and Mondays. Uh, the 30th, we're going to have the card for 2021. And I still have that special going for um, the 2021 reading, 12 cards, $30. Love you all. See you soon. Bye. Bye-bye.